Hello, you are welcome. How to solve for hairs in this nice square root problem? Yeah, let's take this second square root to this side and become minus. So this becomes square root of 3x plus 10, then equals to 2 minus square root of x plus 2 here. Then from what we have here, let's take the square on both sides. We square this side and also we square this side. Square cancel square root here. Then we have 3x plus 10 left, which is equals to on this side, this follows from the expansion where we have a minus b all square, which gives us a square plus b square minus 2ab. Now applying that here, we have a here serving as 2 and b as root x plus 2. We have 2 square, then plus root x plus 2 all square, then minus 2 times 2 times root x plus 2. And from here, this becomes 3x plus 10 equals to 2 square here we have 4. Then square cancel square root here we have plus x plus 2. Then minus 2 times 2 here we have 4. Then root x plus 2 here. Then from what we have here, 4 plus 2 here, that's 6. Then this becomes 3x plus 10. Then equals to 6 plus x minus 4 root x plus 2 here. Then here we can bring the like terms together. And taking x here become minus. So we have 3x minus x then plus 10. Also taking 6 here become minus, which is equal to minus 4 root x plus 2. Then from here, this gives us 2x plus here 4, then equals to minus 4 root x plus 2 here. Then from here, we can factor 2 out here. Then we have 2 into bracket x plus 2 left. Then equals to minus 4 root x plus 2 here. Then what we have here, we can divide both sides by 2. This side as well by 2. Then here 2 cancel out. Then here 2 here 1, 2 here 2. We have minus 2. So here we have x plus 2 equals to minus 2 root x plus 2. The next step also we square both sides. Square this side. Then also square this side. And the square here becomes x square plus 2 square plus 2 times 2 times x which is equals to here, this square here, we affect minus 2, so we have minus 2 square, then times, we affect this as well, root x plus 2, all squared. Then from here, this gives us x square plus 4, then plus 4x, then equals to minus 2 square as well, there is 4. Then square cancel square root here, we have plus x plus 2. Then, replace here, there is no plus. So here we have minus 2 square, that's 4. Then since we are multiplying here, we have into bracket x plus 2 here. Then this becomes x square plus 4 plus 4x. Four now equals to 4 open this bracket, we have 4x plus 8. Then here we have 4x, 4x, 
Now we subtract 4x from both sides. Minus 4x here, minus 4x here. So here, this will cancel each other here. Then what we have left here is 4. Then we have 8 left here. We can take 4 to that side. We have x squared equals to 8 minus 4. This becomes x squared equals to 4. Then taking the square root on both sides here, we have square root here, then square root here, square cancel square root. This gives us x equals to plus or minus 2. So we have two possible values of x. x equals to 2 or we have x equals to minus 2. Then let's check which one is the solution here from what is given, which is root 3x plus 10 then plus root x plus 2 equals to 2 now when x equals to 2 this here become root 3 times 2 plus 10 then plus root 2 plus 2 will this be equals to 2 then here, 3 times 2 here, 6, 6 plus 10, that gives us 16, so we have root 16, plus here, 2 plus 2, that's 4, plus root 4, with this we equal to 2, and root 16 here is 4, plus root 4, that's 2, is it equal to 2, here this is 6, which is not equal to 2, so x is equal to 2 here, is not a solution here now let's check for x equals to minus 2 and from here this becomes square root of 3 times minus 2 plus 10 then plus here we have minus 2 plus 2 and is this equals to 2 and what we have here, 3 times minus 2 minus 6, then plus 10, that's root 4 there, then plus minus 2 plus 2 here, that gives us root 0, is this equals to 2? Then we have here, root 4 as 2, then plus root 0 here, that's 0, is it equals to 2? 2 plus 0 here is 2, which is equals to 2. Now here we have the left hand side equals to the right hand side. And uh, from here, x equals to minus 2 satisfies this given problem. Then this problem here, the solution is therefore x equals to minus 2. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe to my channel and turn the notification bell. See you next class and bye for now.